to present something which we've never done before here at QVC. We have had CDs, we've had DVDs, we have had musical artists joining us here at QVC, but we have never offered theatre tickets. And so, of course, the first time that we offer you theatre tickets, we want to give you the best offer possible. So what we have done is given you the offer of getting this theatre voucher for two people for £79 to actually come to London and see Jersey Boys the Musical. Now, normally, £79 for these two tickets, normally you can pay up to about £135 for top price tickets and these are your top seats as well for £79 it's fabulous you'll be able to find out more about that a little bit later on but right now we are going to actually say hello to the boys it's wonderful to have you here hello. Hello. what a performance well done that was Thank amazing you. Yeah, thanks so much. really really great now I actually had the pleasure of coming to see you guys and it was fantastic I came with my daughter who's 17 years old we have not stopped talking about it I did didn't realise the story of Frankie Valley and the Four Seasons, so I'd really love to find out a bit more about the group, about Frankie Valley, the Four Seasons. What is the musical about for anyone who hasn't seen it? Well, I mean, it's a blue-collar story about you know just some ordinary guys from the uh, the streets of New Jersey, you know, back in the uh, back in the fifties, and they had, a, they had a fantastic life back then. You know, it was, it was, there was a lot of crime, there was you know, there was a lot of poverty and. These guys, you know, you know, four friends who believed in something, and, and that belief was music, and they, and they got together and made a band, and became one of the biggest pop sensations of all time. I believe they've had a decade. They've had a top 100 hit for every single decade since the 1950s to modern day, with more than 175 million records sold before they were even 30 years old. Can you believe that? It's just amazing. Now, I myself know why it's a must-see musical, but why would you say this is a must-see? I think that people will have preconceptions about this show mm -hmm. as a show that's, you know, a band on stage doing the songs that they know. And it's so much more than that. It's, it is the story that plays out right before your eyes. And it's such a fantastic true story that you couldn't have made up. The, the hard work that they had to put in, the trouble that they got into, the way that the four guys ended up being in that same band together. And that all plays out like a fantastic film in front of you. And then you get these songs, you know, laid on top as well. And it just... People are just amazed at how fast-paced it is, how much humour, how much heart there is in the story, and, and then just the great, the great sound of the band on top of that as well. Yeah, it's remarkable, actually, because you sort of imagine, you think, OK, so here are these great songs. It's going to be a musical where I'm just going along to hear some amazing voices, some truly talented people, but it's not just about that. The story will actually have you laughing and crying and feeling just a roller coaster of emotions. It really is a very dimensional, very, very deep musical, actually, and I think to think it's all a true story, it just astounds me. Now, talking about the songs, the music, I was amazed at how many songs I knew, but I didn't realize that it came from Frankie Valley and and the Four Seasons I mean for example you've just sang wonderfully Sherry Baby and of course that was their first ever hit mm. what other songs have we got to look forward to there's um, Can't Take My Eyes Off You mm. um, which Andy Williams covered which everyone knows it from that uh, there's Begging um, which was like on an advert a couple of years ago so kind of the younger generation will recognize that um, Stay. Oh, what a night is a big. Oh, what a night is yeah, a big. Yeah, I've been with them. Bye bye, baby. Makes you do what you want. You know, oh, so many songs. bands have covered their songs over the over the, uh, in the years. I mean, it's, it's just fascinating. It is just amazing. Now, what have been some of the highlights for the four of you? I haven't heard from you yet. Or just Matthew, tell me. <laughs> um, joining the show has been fantastic. I'm the I'm the newest member of uh, the four of us. I've only been here for about six months and stuff. Um, but to, just to get to sing these songs every single night and to tell the story which we've just been talking about every single night um, it's just a treat in itself because you know as you quite rightly said there is so much in there I mean the person as an actor mm -hmm. it's fantastic you know, there's so much detail and so many emotions to go through and things and then singing wise it's just it's epic it sounds great I mean, it sounds great on stage and then just to see the audience at the end who have as you've been saying like laughing and crying and been there with us the entire couple of hours in this journey to see them standing up on their feet at the end and I standing ovation every single night. I was one of those people up there on my feet, clapping away, singing along to Oh What A Night and so many of the other songs as well. Now, you being the newest member, mm -hmm. Ryan, tell me, how many years have you been in Jersey Boys? 43. <laughs> <laughs> it looks so good, doesn't it? <laughs> QVC Beauty Products, maybe. <laughs> I've, I've, been in, um, I've been involved with Jersey Boys for four years and this is my, uh, this is my fourth year actually being in the show now. And um, Yeah, I mean, it's... It, 
I don't know. It's one of those things, you know. You, you know, when I was first getting involved in Jersey Boys, um, it was always, you know, I heard about this show and that it, it was called Jersey Boys, and it was about four guys. And I thought, well, what's that? It sounds like a bunch of strippers. I don't know what, you know, what is that. But when I got to, you know, hear about it, it was Frankie Valli, and then you know the Four Seasons, and then the music which precedes that, and then you, again you hear about the story and the depth, and mm. each character that's in the show is, you know, a fantastic journey that they go on. Well, I think that every little boy wants to be a rock star. Every big boy wants to be a rock star as well, pretty much. I think it's safe to say. But you get to go out there every night and do that. What's been the reaction when you actually get to speak to people straight away after you've performed? I think they're just overwhelmed i think they are surprised by what they got you know there, there are so many people that come with with half expectations and they just are blown away by the precision of the show i mean mm. it's a really fast-paced slick show that it doesn't stop it doesn't pull any punches and they just get so wrapped up in it um and the majority of people that we that do take the time to come and see us at the stage to run away out have generally been before or are immediately planning to come again because they just are so taken with it and I mean, and we have some some fans that have been you know over a hundred times, <laughs> and just they just still get that same that feeling. That is quite that an investment, isn't oh. it? <laughs> <laughs> it's yeah, time yeah, and money. money. Yeah. I think they should invest in one of our vouchers. It's 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 it is a brilliant offer. Do remember though that this offer we brought this to you for the very first time. We've never had anything like this for you in the past. It's seventy nine pounds for two tickets, two of the top price tickets that you normally pay around about £135. So it's a brilliant way for you to get out there and really experience it. This musical has won how many awards? It's just so many. They're almost countless. Is it 53 now? 53 it's, makes it's sort of like it goes up every day. It's it is quite incredible, but there's dancing, there's singing, there's you know, there's girls, there's guys, there's that there's the whole thing, there's really something for everyone, isn't there? Absolutely. Mm. I think what's interesting, just following on from what John was saying, I find that people who come to see the show often set the stage thought that they wouldn't normally go to see a musical, but they love the show. Mm. And that's what I think can make it different to others, mm. is that it's it it's a cross between a play and a mm. rock concert and and a musical. So I find that loads of like like my mates and the blokes who won't go to mm. see musicals, they'll come and then they'll come again. Yeah, because it's so. a little bit docu it's like a documentary as well to sort of to throw that in there too. Because I found the thing that I wanted to do the minute after it finished, I wanted to get straight onto Google and find out more about the guys yeah, that, whose lives I was I was learning about. I mean, just incredible. But I think it's it's so unusual to have a musical that's based on a true story, you know, it's a biographical piece. You know, we as the guys can, can go and find out information about real guys that, that lived in a real place and did real things. And then you have that depth to bring onto the stage and bring it to life. So you, you have that luxury of, of all that information and to, to pass it on. And I think that's, that's one of the keys of its success, mm -hmm. that it's, it's so deep and so rich. And that so people just enjoy it. successful as well. I mean, it's Absolutely. just, it's mind-blowing how many awards this musical wins. That's crazy. I mean, most musicals get, you know, the, the songs get shoehorned into these, you know, the, the scenes and everything else, but, you know, the songs within Jersey Boys come out of real circumstances and real, you know, real emotional moments and, you know, the great writing into the songs. It's yeah. a real show. And the thing that I liked as well was feeling as though I was there. You know, I think a lot of people, the people who grew up with the Beatles, the people who grew up um, with Frankie Valli and the Four Seasons, the people who grew up with all of the, all of the great bands that you think of, um, they say they were so lucky to live in that time. Or for me, the other night, it really was like I was there. I don't want to spoil anything for you, but it really was, even down to the filming, and I shouldn't say any more there, but just the staging of it is incredible. The whole thing, it is like being transformed back to that magical time, don't you think? Yeah, absolutely, yes, yeah. I mean, for us as well. Mm -hmm. it's, it's just amazing. It must be really remarkable to walk a mile in someone else's shoes in that way and actually to experience all of the highs, all of the lows. Has it been emotional for you? It's emotional every night. <laughs> yes, yeah, I mean, traumatic. <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> right, emotional. Most, but... I mean, you walk in those shoes, you go from trainers to crocodile skins. You know, it's, you know, from the highs to the lows to barefoot. I mean, it's a, it's, it's, it's a crazy ride. It mm. is fantastic. And I know you've got a huge following. You've even got a hu huge Twitter fan base who are following you. Yeah. Facebook fans. Joey Barton loves us. Oh, really? Oh, really? Oh, really? Oh, really? Oh, really?
<laughs> I think everybody is going to love you when they, when they get to see you. And of course, with QVC, you can actually get to see the boys. And I really encourage you to do so because it's an incredible thing uh, and an absolute must see. And remember, £79 buys you this voucher. And that is two of your best price tickets for £79 instead of around about up to £135. So definitely take time to see the boys. And boys, thank you so much for being here. You are wonderful. Thanks, 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 thanks. Nice to be here. Thank you.